Hello there, my name is Mr. Smart Donkey. Welcome back to my let's play of Total War Warhammer. With the Empire on Legendary Difficulty. Where we are about... Oh, right, we've called friends the Legendary Lord. As if you guys don't know that yet. Where we are about to fight a battle against um, some Paravon people who got pulled into the war uh, by Wissenland. Pretty unfortunate. Um, their garrison is in reinforcement range for this one. We have this backup army, who I just realized, by the way, are going to be tired because they're in, in uh, March stance. So that's unfortunate, but it's not like the end of the uh, yeah, not the end of the world there. Um, it's slightly in their favor according to the balance of power, but we're gonna give it a go. Actually, let's have a look at the battle map. We have not got the range advantage, but I think our guys are technically better than there. So even though they've got seven, we've got six. We should be able to beat them with our ranged. Okay, that's good at least. We've got some nice hillage on our side of the battlefield, and because they've got such a high amount of cavalry. I'm thinking they might come out at us. I'm not sure if that's actually the case. I haven't really fought too many cavalry heavy battles in this game yet. So I don't know what the AI thinks is best, but... Alright, oh, they do have three extra uh, Yemen archers as well. Mounted Yemen archers, but I think we should be alright in the range department. I'm not too bothered about that. It's it's the, the melee cav, the Knights of the Realm, and they've got one Grill Knight unit as well, which is a 6 sick unit. That I'm mostly worried about. We need to... Well, first of all... Find out if this is a big hill or just a small, like, little, just light uphill. I think it's probably a really slight uphill approach. Yeah, that's not really worth it. If I could sit right there, I'd gladly do so, but none of this other stuff is really great. I could sit in the forest to negate some charge. Probably will do that. Our reinforcements are coming from straight behind us, sadly from over here. Oh, no, actually, they're coming from the perfect location. We want them to come from there. Um, let's have a look at their army. I haven't really seen, I haven't really looked at any like enemy units yet like this. So this is the Peasant Bowman unit. It looks pretty sim. I, mean, I think they look really cool for a Peasant unit. But they do look pretty Peasant-like. Nice of the Realm, this unit looks so awesome. It's a really good unit as well. I think the, I don't know if these guys are better than the Reichsguard or not. I haven't really looked at their stats in comparison. Peasant, oh, no, nope, I was going to say these aren't Peasant Bowman. Men of the Arms are poor arms because they're pretty decent. I mean, they're, they're low tier, but they're pretty good for a low tier unit. And the Mounted Yemen Archers. And then the great uh, Grill Knights aren't on the battlefield yet. But yeah, I got a lot of Knights of Realm. Let's have a look at their stats. Can I actually have a look at their stats when I'm playing Legendary? I don't think so. No. Not even before the battle. It's unfortunate. Anyway. Um, so, it's an somewhat annoying battlefield. I really wish I could set up there, but we're never going to be able to run over there in time. If I set up back here, we're going to be somewhat fighting uphill. We don't... Definitely don't want to do that either. I could try and run into this location, but they're going to get there very fast. So I think I might just want to set up. This is not bad, actually. If I set up more towards the back, just make a line like this. To, yeah, I guess I'm, I could do a slight cheapness and sort of corner camp. Which is obviously quite cheap, but to be fair, this is the best part of the battlefield right here for us. That we can actually get to. And... Our reinforcements are coming from here as well, so it actually makes sense. I'm not gonna like set up all the way towards the line, but I'm gonna I am gonna try and make it so they can't really flank around us. I mean it makes sense, like why wouldn't I, right? It's kinda cheap, but it's just it's the best location. Like I, why wouldn't I make use of the best location? because uh, the forest will negate their charge. It also will make my ranged weaponry worse, but it will make their worse as well. Um I'm going to set up free on this side, and we've got the Halberdiers coming from over here, so I'll set them up over here. And then I'll just make this my entire line. Obviously not like this, but yeah. Um, and then all the swords units we're about to get, which are six of them, are going to be reserve. Uh, and then that's it, really. Okay. All right. So we're gonna set up around, up around there-ish, I think. Where is them? And yeah, the end of the map is right there. We, we do definitely want to make sure they can't really flank around. So, and I want to make use of the forest as much as possible. Uh, let's run them into position. These guys are gonna be tired, so that's another reason to just keep them at the back and only use them when I actually have to. Uh, and then you guys are gonna sit with them. They're tired as well. They're very tired. That's not fair. They're supposed to be tired, not very tired. Is that from just running onto the battlefield like that? It seems a bit unfair. But these guys are all going to be reserves. Uh, Bowman. 
I don't know where to really put these guys, to be honest. Because obviously the cavalry is going to be mostly coming from the flanks, so and we definitely need some help killing the cavalry as well. There's another one. I thought there was another one. Um, let's actually put spread them out a little bit. Put two there. Keep two on this side. You guys should run over here as well. Alright. Wait, am I missing something here? Where are you going there? Oh, right. I don't know why. Um... You haven't got anything. You've got Accusation, which is good against single targets. You have Leadership and Charge Resistance. We need to make sure to use that. Right. So it looks like they're setting up their entire army, waiting for the reinforcements before they do anything. I feel like we're fighting an uphill battle, but it's not as bad if you look down here. Like, it's actually pretty good. It looks like it might be slightly uphill, but that's not going to make any difference. But if you look at this, like, it looks like this is much higher than this is. Well, not much higher, but a little bit. Okay, it looks like they're already going full on around the flank here. You know what? Maybe I'm going to be cheap about this. Somewhat cheap. Get these guys right behind them. Um, looks like I actually need to adjust the line a little bit anyway. We're really not lined up for this properly. And I might want to make my line a little less long anyway. We've got enough units to cover everything. And we've got a lot of cavalry though. Let's make it a little less long. And then get these guys over here. Eh. Don't know really how I want to do it. I want to make sure they can't flank around us, but I also want to make sure I can get in there fast enough if I have to. Okay. A lot of fucking Knights of the Realm here. Their charge bonus is definitely going to be negated. Like, I think it's like 30% or something less. Like, 70% movement. Reduce the speed and combat efficiency of large units and allow some troops to hide. Uh, it makes their combat efficiency worse as well. And there's the Grill Knights coming in. And definitely not an amazing charge. Normally they would get straight through those units, which obviously is not what you want. Alright, charge resistance thing. Looks like some units might be coming in here in a minute, so... Uh, I want to get these guys up a little bit, because right now they're probably not doing much. See, so yeah, we want to make sure we are wide enough to receive this. Let me get this guy a little wider. Alright, I didn't end up using that. I don't know why I used the leadership right away, that seemed pointless. Oh, that units took a full charge. Got some more units in there. Because we got these guys over here. I'll make sure they don't get caught. Oh my god, this unit's getting obliterated. Okay. Get another unit sort of in there. Probably want to set up a line again, to be honest. Let's receive them again instead of going after them. Uh, right. I should probably try and find their general or something. Our general. I don't really want to send them against that shit. Oh my god, they're already through the middle here. What the fuck? This forest is also the downside that I can't fucking see what's going on. I feel like I'm missing a unit here. I guess, yeah, there's one of them right there. I don't feel like we're doing that well right now. God damn it, there we go. Fucking hell, I really hate that. So, my range units, I think, are like in melee here. That unit's definitely doing something. Right, you need to probably get in there as well. Just get in somewhere. Just fucking. Oh my god, I hate that I can't click on the actual unit, like the health bar. Oh, there's a general right there. Right, I want you to kill him as well. Oh, fucking hell. This guy. Use accusation on him as well. Just use some stuff, because why not? And I want you to actually kill him specifically. Oh, that's not him. Uh, him. No, not him. Where is he? Fuck's sake. There we go. What's going on here? Okay, we're killing a Knights of the Realm unit. Warriors flee. I haven't got any spare units here, except for all these units that aren't doing anything. 
Fucking hell, I can't click on any units. It's such an issue with this. Alright, that unit's shaken. These guys got morale of fucking legends, apparently. Uh, how's this side doing? Very well, it looks like. Need to get some units in there. Oh shit. Alright, they got a damsel. They got a lot of fucking troops over there still. I got range units in melee here. I got men dying. That's what I've got. What is this unit? Where are you? That 42 men. What are you guys doing? Just get back. My general. I'm not sure what he's doing all the way over there. I think I told him to go after our general, but... Why don't you come back and deal some shit over here? Is that their... Are we fighting the general over there? Find their man at arms. Probably not a very good idea. There is Mark. He's still... Okay, the enemy lord is wounded. That's pretty good. I was going to say, he's still killing. I might want to switch that, but I guess I don't want to switch that at all. Uh, fucking... Okay, I need a lot of you to fucking leave this line. Let's go, f go over there. Oh my god, I hate that so much. Where's this guy at? Get in there. Okay, I don't know what we're... I don't know how we're doing, really. I'm, very, I'm having a very hard time distinguishing our situation at the moment. Oh my god, there's walking past. Alright, one of you just comes to turn around. There's so many units over there, there's probably a lot of peasant bowmen, to be honest, but still. So much shit. Oh yeah, I need to kill that stupid guy over there. Accuse, ac ac accuse him of something. He did it. That's the guy. That's the one you're looking for. Stop fleeing, Cravens. This guy is too weak to really be sent in there again. About to be attacked from the rear here, which isn't very good. You're infantry, right? No, you're ranged. What the fuck? I didn't see his, like, range indicator. Ah, right, you need to come over here. Uh, you guys deal with this shit. You keep killing him. Those harbor deers have been pretty good so far, I think. Alright, you guys are done. Get back in here. What the fuck is going on right now? Did we ac accuse that guy enough yet? Is he dead? I don't know. I know they've got a lady back somewhere, or a damsel. Swordsman. I think we're winning this engagement now, but it's just a matter of, like, actually... ...cleaning up all this fucking cavalry. Need to have these range units just kill the cavalry off. Okay, you guys, those are all shattered. They're not gonna actually know they're broken. They're gonna come back at some point. This unit got absolutely blasted, I guess, by ranged. This unit's literally just... Oh my god. They're all coming back. And they're broken again. Some of those probably will break again. Get in there. I know I told you you guys aren't good enough anymore, but you have to do it. We have too much of a bulk, like fighting one or two units here. I think we're breaking through now, though. You. Shoot at that guy right there. Oh man, our general's actually taking a bit of a beating. Let's get him out of there. Oh, he's over there. I think he's just been getting shot. No, no, he's been in combat with that unit. Right. Get out of there. Are you melee? No, you're not. Oh, we got a melee guy in there, though. Yeah, you just pull out, though. Okay, I think we're winning this now. You guys will come back, get in there. You guys, they're completely gone now. Alright, this did not go well. I'd say that much, but... Can't really complain, I suppose. Yeah, they're losing morale pretty rapidly. Just gotta catch them somehow. Are you still dying or no? Because I feel like you are. Oh, you're flying. I just wanna get him out of there. Need to make sure I don't lose my level 15 general, whatever he is. Alright. Uh... I need to accuse some more people. There must be still a damsel around here somewhere. No idea where though. Oh, they're all routing. Yeah, they're gonna route soon. Victory's in our grasp. Well, we did it, but it wasn't pretty. It was sure not pretty. This guy's fucking in there. How many kills did my generals get and such? 46, 4, and 22. To be honest, he killed a general and that melee specialist as well, I think. I don't know where that damsel is. I wouldn't mind killing her. I think all this stuff's gonna get away. There's nothing I can do about it. Uh, killing their captain of the garrison. Actually, you can kill stuff. You're flying, Mount. I don't think anyone else is on a Mount. You're not on a Mount, are you? Oh no, my hidden units. They're being revealed. What will I do? Um, 
Yeah, maybe we did kill the damsel at some point. I have no idea. I don't see her, but I don't remember ever targeting her, so it would have been an accident if we did. Oh no, I killed the damsel. How could I? Yeah, it's not pretty. I lost a few swordsmen. I don't know if anyone actually died. Possibly. Possibly not. I lost a few swordsmen here, one here. Halberdier survived. All the spearmen survived. All the range units survived. So yeah, we lost three, four swordsmen, and I don't know if they're dead or not. They might have, might have, might be alive still. Oh, he's actually making it. Okay, let's do. Uh, let's keep that going for a second. Then I was gonna end it, but let him get some damage in. If he's there, you go. Kill some peasant bowmen. I'm pretty sure the peasant bowmen did a real number on my guys because. We could. We had nothing to stop them, really. My range units. I don't know. I didn't really. The forest is just so vision impairing, which makes sense. It's a forest, but like I couldn't really tell what was going on, so I never really was able to target the right units. I never really bothered even because shooting at units that are in the forest is kind of pointless anyway. I really should triple speed this though for now. The problem is that we still need to like actually attack these people as well a little bit. Um, like, we need to take a town or something. Oh, I guess we don't have to, yeah, this, this one army can do that. I need to pull back the reinforcement army, though, to so I can start recruiting again, because it still does need to get bigger. This definitely isn't as good as Deathclaw, I don't think, but he's going to get a he's gonna get a griffin mount at some point as well. He's just pushing units all over the place. He's really not doing too much damage there. When you're reducing their health, I imagine, oh, they're gone. Right, I don't think there's much else we can reach. Close victory. Well, at least it wasn't Pyrrhic. Did I lose any full units? Not in the main army. These guys are all alive still. That's for sure. Lost a thousand men there. Wow, we lost more than half of the reinforcement army. But they lost a lot as well. Their peasant bowmen are still pretty good. A lot of their cavalry might be dead though. If they only survive, it's just a few units. Actually, no. Did they? They ran away, didn't they? I didn't even think about that. Yeah, they ran away. So this army should be dead. Because it's their second... Like, they, you can't run away and then... I don't know, I'm still not entirely sure about the mechanics. I think it might they might be alright if, if it's their own territory or something. No, I don't think that's true either. I think they just die, no matter what. I don't know, sometimes I've, I have seen units survive, so I don't know for sure. None of, no one's dead there and no one's dead here. Perfect. So we survived. Their garrison's still pretty good, but that's fine. So this army should be dead. Yeah, it is. I think it... Pretty sure it just died. Spell shield. No, it survived. And it survived of a lot of units, actually. To the provinces. And I can't besiege the town immediately. Oh man, that's rough. What does the Emperor bid? I must keep my holy no. That's why well, I can, but I can't like take it right away. Unless we killed the entire garrison somehow, but we sure didn't. Oh man, that's really rough. Oh, and I can't even like I have to actually besiege it, first of all, just so I can leave. Maybe I maybe I keep the siege going. I will I will lose a few units if I do. It's not even that good though, is it? It isn't. But he might leave, and if he doesn't, oh, I think if he attacks me, we'll be able to take him. He doesn't have much cavalry anymore. It's just infantry now. And a lot of archers. We're, our crossbowmen is still pretty good. Yeah, we could be able to. Yeah, we would take him if he attacks us. Just leave all of my wounded guys out of there. Alright, let's just do it. And if he stays, then we can do the old trick of attacking him with our reinforcement army. He didn't even get a level up from that, that's pretty disappointing actually. Impossible. impossible. Alright, we got a little bit of money left from that. Or a little bit of money again from that. 2500. Does seem pretty perfect that I could go for that. Um. Mm, all right. I also now I'm gonna keep him here, out of the range of those other banshees. Just to do your thing. What's your chance actually over here? Forty-two. Might be worth doing that. If anything, it's for a, be good for a level up. Yeah, we can't recruit obviously because we're in forced march stance. Um, I really don't like the fact the fact that this place is gonna rebel again. I wish they'd just attack it already, but they're not going to. This place is going to rebel too. And it's not going to have as long as a time. 
Um, I could recruit a general in here as well, but it's going to cost me so much money if I do that. Alright, well, let's just find out what happens right now. Actually, you know what? Paravon might take peace right now. Probably not. I think we need to kill a full army off before they do that. Where the hell are they? There they are. Uh, they'd consider it. I mean, that's good enough. A commandment, you say? Oh my god, this place is so unhappy. We got an army in the capital, but... This place is just so bad, though. Like, we need growth here, for sure. Well, that gives my answer of what that was going to go for. There you go, growth. It's going to rebel regardless. Like, that's going to happen. Nothing I'm going to do about that. But we have an army there, so that's easy to deal with for once. All these stupid rebellions happening all over the place. Alright, no Asian actions for one. Oh, frick, I forgot to put call friends in. Oh, there's an army on the way towards Camp Robot. Alright, moved away. So that's an easy take at least. That's good. <laughs> there's another rebellion right there. Different flag as well. Rebellion. Oh no. That's good. Uh, I don't really want to spend money on this, but sure. Block army. Okay. Hello? There we go. Assassinate failure. Assassinate failure. Right. I can run in there, because I reckon he can reach... He's in March stance. He looks like he can just about... I don't know if he can actually reach in one term, and I might want to run over there anyway. Some level ups to deal with. Man, things are really messy right now. I really hate it when things are messy. Like, I just don't... I don't like playing a messy campaign. But there's not much I can do about it right now. He's inside, right? Yeah. I'll let my guys replenish for another turn. I could if I wanted to. No, I don't really want to. Well, I'm just thinking, like, I could I could get a call friends at an army that's a little more important. Like, one that's actually doing battle and stuff. Alright. If I got lucky, no one dies here, but... Might not be that lucky. Mm, I don't think anyone died. Well, it's pretty lucky then. Here's some speed for you. Oh. Oh. I don't think I can handle happiness, unhappiness right now. That's pretty, uh, pretty good right about now, though. We have an army here. Fuck it. I'm gonna do it. I don't tend to, but... I feel like I kind of need some money at this moment. Wait. Oh, for f I was gonna say, how do we not have more money? God damn it. Okay, well, we fixed our, finished our stupid... Quest where we have to get 10 grand, so we lost 5 grand. With the fund secured, the Emperor orders his factors to secure necessar necessary raw, rare materials that, so that the required additions to the astrolobe can be made. With the adjustments to their magical astrolobe completed, the wizards of the Celestial College report back their findings, and the port portents could not be more dire. A great orc war boss has arisen somewhere in the land south of the Black Mountains. His fiercer reputation has gathered many greenskinned tribes behind him in a while, which is now headed for the main route from, from the Badlands into the Empire, Blackfire Pass. The first priority is to prevent further orc warbands from traveling to join the Wa. Meanwhile, the messengers are sent to summon all allies to face this threat. Alright. Got some level ups now. Let's get some root marching. Oh. Okay, I can get him back to a helm guard to recruit units if I wanted to. You, sir. I'm gonna keep going. Oh, or I can get Faust Seeker. Yeah, get that. Oh, hold on. Did I just. Mm, that might be a little better, actually. Let me go for that. Noise. Another level up. A bit more silver bullets. How much is that doing, actually? On 372, 390, 416. Mm, it's decent. It's actually not as high as I was hoping it would be. I mean, I could have done the math beforehand, but I was just expecting more for some reason. Ooh. 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 Ooh, sorry. Um, right, so we can get Demigriff Knights and Outriders. Actually, no, we can't get these ones, but I can get Demigriff Knights if I wanted to, which I do, but I can't really afford that right now, can I? Um, just wondering. 
I could keep this building available and recruit the units in this army instead. Oh man, you can make them even though the, arm, the, the building is damaged. That's pretty crazy. Oh, looks so good. Hey, Empire Knights as well here. Not Reichsguard though, because I need that special building for them. It's tempting, but three turns is too long anyway, so it's not going to happen. But I think I will possibly keep these buildings for this turn. What is this giving us? The armory. Can make four units a turn here as well? Yeah. Even though the buildings are damaged, I guess. I'm not going to repair it. Fucking hell, I don't want to repair it that much anyway. Yeah, that's way too expensive. But I will make use of the replenishment or the recruitment for now. So we're going to move this army up 50%. And go into encamp stats. Not that we have to, but we may as well. And then we're going to recruit two more halberdiers. And... I think I'm just going to make this not a standard army for now. I need two more swordsmen as well. Let's get those. If I want to make it a standard army, no great swords or anything. I just need to get an army over there as fast as possible. I've got five global recruitment now because of that building. But I don't really want to make more right now. Not from global. Unless I do. Yes, I'll make two from global. And a mortar. For no reason. And then next turn we make four... Hmm. Actually, you know what? I might get four Empire Knights in here. So not Reichsguard, so they're a little worse. But it's still four Cavalry. And having four Cavalry is such a massive advantage. Then again, we're, we're up against a lot of Cavalry there. I don't know what these guys are. And yeah, it's also Cavalry based. Well, I can make that decision next turn. No, I don't take four turns to make. I don't think I'm going to go for that. Just because they are two turns, I mean. Because it takes two turns. Um, unless I make them now instead of these four. Okay, that, that works. The decision has to be made now, though. This turn, I mean. Not this particular moment. So I cancel these four. I make these four instead this turn. I have enough money to do that. Then... It takes three turns. No, right now it only takes two turns, because these are done. Then I make... Then I make four more next turn, and then, yeah, we're done in two turns. Never mind, this doesn't actually speed it up at all. For some reason, I thought it did. But I'm an idiot. Well, it does. No, it doesn't. No, it literally doesn't make any difference. I'm just being an idiot. Um, <clears throat> well, never mind then. Scratch all that. So I'm going to keep these buildings for now. I guess I don't need this one. Then. No, let's get rid of this. Um, I'll keep these other ones, though. Actually, I only need this one, don't I? No, I need uh, for the harbor deers. I'm going to need the, the armory. So, yeah, I'll keep this for now as well. Okay. Now, these are free grand. So this army, it doesn't even have to be full. This would probably be already enough, but I may as well wait until it's full. And then we lift both sieges. And probably have to deal with several armies here. Fucking hell, that's unfortunate. Um... Oh, nice. Um... I wonder, out of curiosity, I'm not going to take it regardless. The grail, of old, could hope if they would become my vassal, I would honestly think about it, but right now, they don't want to, so... I feel like vassalage on legendary is maybe just impossible, because I've yet to see anyone actually go for anything like it. Alright, I'm going to run you into... Oh, I can't even... Yeah, I can. Yeah, it just does that weird thing where it doesn't show the right number. This place is so... Un well, it's only minus six now, but... Minus 20 fucking 4. Holy hell. Minus 18 here. The rebellion happens near Woodbutt. I can't... Well, this army's weakened now. Oh yeah, we're gonna attack here this turn. Yeah, there's no, no question about that. Right, so Derek Fluss. Let's uh, get you the hell out of here. I got someone else who wants to go. Really? I need to pay you again? That's weird. Maybe because it's a different army? Was he in a, a different army before? I guess he was actually. Yeah. Yeah, he was in this one. It's because we lost one here as well, or in the other. I had like I had to switch around several generals anyway. So in this one, it costs no, it still costs like twenty five. But it was this army. But I will put him in the weaker one now. Doesn't matter. That means he's got to he's got to mate with him instead of uh, the captain who's over here anyway. Right. Here you go, a new army. Now these guys get to see how you do. That also means you're. 
Yeah, these are different items. These aren't his items. Fuck, that's annoying. Uh, um, I was thinking there's a different way to do this. I don't think there is. I do want the good items on him. He needs to have his own items back. Yes, my lord. I, will marshal the band. I definitely don't want this guy. What does the we had another guy available again as well, didn't we? Oh no, Hans Food Fiddler. Yeah, he's gonna take over the other army. Okay, yeah, okay, fuck it then. Well, yeah, he's gonna come back next turn. So we'll just replace Rudy right now, and then next turn this guy's gonna get replaced as well anyway. Although his guy, he's technically the same level as the other guy right now, but I think I'd rather have the other guy. Okay, well, so we're just gonna replace him then. Because he does have... Yeah, he has Call Francis equipment on currently. Alright. Oh god, Call Francis, you're such a legend. Alright. Uh, Rudy. Rudy of the Red Nose Reindeer. That's him right there. Oh, he's got the same stupid face as this guy. Alright. Okay, I don't know. Rudy's got one of those, so let's just take that one. So he's a cook. That's Rudy is. Yeah, that one. That Rudy? Nope. Rudolph the Red Nose. Rudy. Rudy, 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 Rudy. Rudy. Rudy is very rude. Very sorry about all that. Where are you? Is that you, Rudy? It is. Alright, one more. I'll source the bottom somewhere. There you go. Alright. And I want you to get... Uh, your Potion of Toughness back. The 20% ward save. Your crazy good item, of which we have two. Oh no, this is a sword. Never mind, it's not the good one. That one. Armor, though. That's the good one. Not that one that one. Right. It's back in action. I, see no other option. Yes. I don't see another option either, to be honest. Uh, yes. You've got less to move. This will bolster the nation. Uh, it looks like your movement is a lot worse. Oh, this army must have gotten blocked. Okay, well in that case we attack with you. I have to siege him out again in it anyway. Yeah. But that's okay. That's going to work out quite well actually this time around. And I'll show you why momentarily. I guess these aren't available yet. Yeah, okay. Um, because we can now move them up slightly and then go into. Are we seizing the town right now? Yeah, we are. This is, he's like really far away from the town, don't you think? Like he's he's really far away. It's like he's not besieging it. We must attack. He's not. Wait. Yeah, he is. Why do you have a circle there then? That was really that's Raise your weapons. buggy. Nope, I don't think that's supposed to happen. Anyway, as long as it counts as being besieged and it's good to go. Wait, are we in reinforcement range? No, we're not. Fucking hell, how is he not? There's something clearly going on here. I hope it's not so bugged that he can't actually besiege the town. We well, have to move up a little closer, I guess. Which is kind of weird, but well, if you're not. For fucks. Let's just move over here. It doesn't really matter, but to battle, to strengthen the empire. If that's not a reinforcement range, it's a bug. Okay, it's a reinforcement range. Never mind. No bug. Well, it's still kinda of buggy. But <laughs> that's okay. That magic there is through the freaking roof. Okay. This place is gonna rebel soon as well. Great. That's what I was hoping for. I love these rebellions. I want more of them. Um, is there any point upgrading this? There's a good chance we're going to lose this place soon. Let's start upgrading the moot. So? Alright, so we're in here. Honestly, he could decide to just now be like, hey, I'm going to go for this place instead because it's an easy target. Um, we've got no money left. This army is going to probably keep going on the attack because they're still a pretty wounded army over there. They replenish faster because they still have to get back in their own town. Right. So very annoying shit currently going on. If I can handle all the rebellions here, then we're just so much better off, because then I have a spare army, essentially. If we could take all these guys out... Well, the thing is, after I've taken Brion, I would want Ca Ca the castle of Carcassonne as well. So I may have to go after them as well. Um, in the east, we're generally pretty good. We're about to take Castle Templehof. 
And then they only have one province left, which should is actually be doable with one army after Castle Drakonov's been taken, because there's a large garrison in there. Um, and then we can start working on getting all these provinces under our control. If we've killed this Midland army, I can't imagine they've got many more, to be honest, because they really aren't that strong. Let's have a quick look at diplomacy again. My hand hovers close to my blade. I wonder if I want to take peace just for now. Alright, I'll take that. My hand hovers close. It makes it makes it a little easier to I do all the protecting me. and defending and stuff because it means I can mo use that army to take care of rebellions instead. What do Sigmar's sorry gets need? I'm not a sorry get, sir. You're gonna be sorry I'll soon if you keep up that attitude. Talk at me and you they changed their mind completely about the trade. Welcome, men. I'm still trustworthy. Nothing has changed there. They've gone down the strength rank again. We're rank three. Scaling is actually losing a little bit. That's good. The time for talk is over. Somehow, oh no, never mind. November counts at 14. I thought this said four for a second. I was like, what? The f Wait, are, I think we are four actually. Is that beyond uh, illogical? Right, I'm not going to repair that. Minus 28. Yeah, that's obviously the you know, minus 30 is going to go away next turn. There are this, the best or the highest. Um, that's interesting actually. The highest uh, corruption there. Fucking hell. He's dead again. Or wounded again. This is probably in their favor as well, isn't it? No, no, it's not. Well, that's good at least. It's not full army. But yeah, what's his face? He's fucking wounded again. Yeah, just as I put him in there. Well, I'll take your town. Gladly. Don't mind me. That was Manfred as well. Really? That's fucking stupid. Well, I don't know. Fucking hell, that's my agent gone. But I don't really regret it or anything. It's, that's pretty really stupid, though. Did we get the town? Did they all die? No, uh, something survived in there. Man, that's fucking stupid. That's why I don't like. They really need to fix that. Where like a single entity or just lower numbers takes so much more damage than anything else. They really need to fix that because that is just a stupid mechanic. And the fucking fact that what's his face is dead as well. Well, wounded again. Call friends out for another four turns. Just as I did all the fucking swapping around of the items as well. Plus, I can't even hire the other guy back in. So I'm gonna have to put Rudy into that army now, which means everything is gonna be completely fucked. Well, that's him gone again. Killed in battle. Ready for duty. Yeah, there you go. He's gonna have to take over this army now. Assassinate failure. Assault unit success in Paravon. Assault unit critical failure. That's good. So one agent in Paravon is gone for now. Another pit fighter, another public order, another 10% physical resistance, Luxstone. Rebellion imminent in Sterland, minus 18, and in Western Sylvania. For fuck's sake. Alright, and you have to go in there. At least we can take this town, which is actually where, this is where the rebellion's gonna happen. Okay, that, that's gonna be an easy one to deal with at least. Alright. Foreign trespasser, yeah, I saw that dwarf. Okay. Well, there's a lot of shit going on currently. We're gonna we're gonna easily be able to handle the rebellion here. So we've got two armies right here. Actually, we'll probably have one because I guess I'll move the other one back, and then we'll just wait here before we continue on. Actually, I can I can send this one back to Woodbot, so that's all right. Um. So yeah, we got assaulted here, and the other one got wounded, so that's all right. We need to make four more units. This guy is gonna wait another one or two turns, and then go on the. Oh, for fuck's sake, he's over there now. That's pretty annoying. What happened here? Did I get rid of a building here or something? This must. Oh, this is a new. No, never mind. I think we just just fixed this, didn't we? Uh, Bordalo. Yeah. Okay. I guess it's just over here for some reason instead of like this one. Um. Okay. So yeah, they're gonna besiege. I guess they're gonna go for Aquatan, which we should be all right in, to be honest. But we, yeah, we're one turn away from getting on the move at least, so that's good. And maybe I'll just send this guy down. I can attack this guy, this place right now. They get full garrison there now, but it's not enough, is it? I don't know. Maybe I'll take that and get peace with them, because I don't necessarily want this last town, to be honest, because it means I have to go further to, further south. Yeah, that might be it. Maybe I'll attack them, get peace, and then that's good. Um, but we'll deal with that next time. So for now, thank you all very much for watching once again. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day, and goodbye.